Welcome to Den of Tools. Hey, ho, guys and gals, it's Red, your friendly neighborhood tool bear, back again here in the old Den of Tools. And today we're here to talk about bench top planers. We're going to help you not waste your money and get the planer that you need at the price you need. And basically, there's going to be three levels that we're going to talk about. So we're going to educate you on that. So speaking of education, I want to say a huge shout out, a huge thank you to our sponsor today, which is Skillshare. They help educate, inform, and, and make you a, a better bear, if you would. But let's get talk about more about them in a little bit. So real quick, let's cover some of the basics about these planers. So these are small Portable bench top planers, often referred to as lunchbox style planers for most of these. Reason being is those little wings fold up and it's kind of like a lunchbox. Makes it easy, makes it portable, makes it easy to store. You take it out when you need it, you put it away when you don't. That's the real convenience for these things. Now, one thing I want to do is I want to kind of pull away all the plastic and, and sheet metal on it so you can see underneath the real components that we're talking about. And that really is, you've got this four post system here. They're all gonna have that. It's a rack and pinion geared system on these posts to move the, the mechanism up and down. You got the cutting head then that sits in, in the middle here. And the, the bladed system that's inside that cutting head is what's really gonna make the difference. Whether it's a two blade or a three blade or a spiral or a helical, we're gonna talk more about those later. But the first difference you're gonna see is in this frame. So many of these are gonna be a, a a, uh, a two pole system where it's got two poles connecting the top that's going to make it a little more rigid kind of kind of box it out on the cheaper ones you'll see a single pole connecting uh, the two sides that's going to be your your kind of budget options and speaking of budget we got to start with win now win is without a doubt i think going on right now that the cheapest you can get into this and i know people who have this i know people here on youtube creators here on youtube who have the win planers and they really enjoy them all right, uh, you know, they're the great bang for the buck. My issue with Wynn has always been the customer service with them. Uh, the, you know, you, if you need warranty service, you got to send it off. They're kind of notorious for being kind of lackadaisical about it. Uh, basically, you buy them with the expectation that you're not getting a warranty with it. If you're okay with that and, uh, and rolling the, the bones on it, then this is the, the way you're gonna go with it. At $290, there's not much that's gonna be cheaper than that for an entry-level planer, unless you find a good one used. Here's the problem. These machines, when they get worked, they get worked hard. So looking at used ones, you got to be really careful because they can be, even if they clean them up, they can be used and abused. Porter cable. Porter cable is the next one. Again, this is going to be another single bar kind of system connected at the top. This is going to be a budget level one. You're looking at 328. Really not much difference between the two systems. They're both going to be a two knife system. I, I don't know. I do you, Is that worth the extra money to have that name brand on there for you? Porter Cable is not really well known for, I mean, they do have some higher end woodworking st stuff. This isn't it. All right, moving along. Craftsman, this is the new, I guess it's replacing that Porter Cable kind of, because this is the new budget DIY weekend warrior system that coming at you from, from uh, Stanley Black & Decker. Their price on this is $329. I mean, it's nice, it's bright, it's red, it's shiny. Has that Craftsman name that we all know and love since we were Cubs. But again, you're looking at a single bar system here. 329 is that going to be worth it for you for the for the price difference you might have a little better luck with the warranty but you know question is do you want to box up and ship it off if you're not near a, a customer service center power tech power tech used to be the real cheapy on the block where you, uh, you can get like little nine inch uh, band saws and drill presses and stuff like this 344 dollars i don't know what to say about that i i don't see myself going with power tech a single bar system here like this, a real entry level system at a not quite so entry level price. Then we got Win. Win is really killing it when it comes to these planers. I got to tell you, this is a three blade system. So the other one's been a two blade system. We got a three blade system here for three hundred and forty two. They even have a big brother spiral cut. We'll talk about the spiral head in a little bit. But this is a three blade system for three hundred forty two dollars. That that's a phenomenal price. And you're also looking at. Let's see if I can get an angle on it so you can see inside there. You can see how it folds up nice and compact, but you're looking at a two bar system there for connection. So it's going to be a little bit more rigid. It's going to be a little bit more stable, which you're going to need really when you're do, using the three blades on that. Now we're talking about the blades. So we're talking about the cutter heads. Let's let's back up and talk about the cutting system a little bit. So these cutting systems are usually, they're usually a two blade or three blade, and they use blades that look literally like this, like a blade. Now... Putting these in can be tricky. They're super sharp, easy to slice yourself. Make sure you use a proper tool. Often they have like a little magnetic tool or something in there. All of them are gonna be a little bit different. Some of them are easier to install. Some of them are harder to install. 
Uh, now, if you are in a real budget and you're looking for a, a single blade system, they do have those uh, $34.98. Go, good luck with that. All right, the bear kids, the bear kids. Anyway, advanced, let's talk about advanced cutting heads. We've got spiral and then we have something called helical. Now, the only difference between these, let me zoom in here so you can see this. The helical, as you can see, the blade matches the spiral pl uh, pattern of the uh, of the cutting head, whereas on the spiral, I know this is kind of weird, the blade is perpendicular to, not perpendicular, but it, it, it's a 90 degree angle to, yeah, the 90, it's, it's perpendicular to the workpiece. I don't know. Anyway, basically the blades are straight. These blades are at an angle. Allegedly the, the helical is the top of the line. The spiral is just below it. And then the three blade and then the two blade, that's kind of the hierarchy when it comes to these kind of blades. You'll get, if you get any of these forums, you'll get some heated discussions as to what's the best kind of blade for what, but that's the way this kind of goes. Now with the two, the top two, the spiral and the helical, they both use blades like this. The nice thing with this is if you've got a nick in one of your blades, these have blades on all four sides. You just loosens it, loosen it, turn it, and you've got another blade head. Problem with these other ones is if if you nick one of these blades, you've got to replace the whole blade. Now, some systems I've seen have double-sided where there's two edges on it, but I'll take four over two any day of the week. And on top of that, with these, if you do completely just wreck one of them, you just replace one small blade. You're not replacing the whole length of the blade. It, it, they're expensive to get into, but once you got them, I think your maintenance level and, and your price level of, for supporting them is going to go down quite a bit. All right, so there, I hope I educated you on that. And speaking of education, let's have a second to talk about our sponsor, Skillshare. Online learning is quickly becoming a primary source of education, and Skillshare is leading the way. Their community allows millions of creative people to join together in learning and even inspiring others. They offer classes on a wide variety of topics. You'll not only learn, but you'll also interact through class projects. One of my favorite features is that they're also adaptive to fit your schedule. That makes it perfect for busy tool bears like me. My family has always believed that learning is not a destination, it's a journey, and that you're never too old to learn new tricks. Now, Skillshare offers, as I said before, a wide variety of topics. Some of my favorite are photography, cooking, and productivity. A class I recently finished was the Productivity Masterclass, How to Do More While Working at Home. Yeah, we all know how 2020 is going. And as wonderful as it sounds to be able to work from home, it does come with some significant challenges. Those are how to stay focused and say be productive while being at home. And classes like this are helping me do just that. Members get access to thousands of ad-free classes with hands-on projects and feedback from a community of millions, all for less than $10 a month. And the first 1,000 people who click the link in my description below will get a free trial to Skillshare Premium. All right, thanks again to them. And, you know, let's get back into the planers here. Let's talk about Harbor Freight, the Bauer planer. Now, this used to be the real bargain, you know, uh, way to go because this was a two-bar system here. We're talking about a lot of, get out of the way there. We're talking about some of these two-bar systems here. This was a great system when it came out and was at 200, and we'd see it around $250. Now, the system hasn't gotten any worse, but the price sure has. It's up to $360. Are there going to be sales on this going forward? Yeah, of course there are. Are they going to get down to $250? Uh, I, I really doubt it. All right, now, right now, there is a 10% off coupon, no exclusions going around, and you get your free blue flashlight. Look at that. So that will, you know, knock, what, $36 off the price of that. And that makes it actually a fairly appealing system there. So this is a two-blade system. Most of the other ones are talking about a two-blade system. The one win was a three-blade system. But let's move on and talk about some other stuff. We got Triton here. I, I don't get Triton, all right? That supposedly they're a higher-end system, but every time I look at them, I look at the price and go, that tool doesn't, to me, justify the price. There's nothing but the features in this that justify that kind of price. Maybe I'm missing it. Maybe you guys know more about it than I do. I know April Wilkerson's a, a big proponent of Triton stuff. I don't know, but I, I haven't had a chance to try it. If you have, comment down below. I'd love to hear from you. Delta, Delta back in the day used to be one of the real go-tos when it came to these lunchbox planers. They had a good system at a good price, but it seems like a lot of people have caught up. A lot of people are eating their lunch, if you will, get the lunchbox, eating their lunch, get it? <laughs> anyway, uh, this is, it's a good solid system, all right? I'm not, I'm not going to say that it's not. Uh, it's a three-blade system. 
It's, I, I think it's, I'm pretty sure it's a three blade system. I only did a four column, blah, 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 blah. Nope, I stand correct. It looks like it's a two blade system, which again makes you more of a kind of a head scratcher there wondering why they're charging nearly $400 for a system like that. I, it might just be the name. And you know, one of the things is look at this, look at the power head on this. And then look at the power head on some of these other ones. And it kind of makes you, again, scratch your head because they kind of look almost like they came out of the same shop or something. I'm not saying they did. I'm not saying they didn't. All right. Grizzly. We got the Grizzly 2 horsepower here. Uh, features two reversible HSS knives. So this is, you got the knives. We talked about the reversible on the straight blade knives. But it's still just a two knife system. Like the metal case. But I'll be honest, you know, the more I've been seeing it, the more I, you know, you think about it around the shop. On something that you move a lot, maybe a plastic housing is a little bit better. It's got a little bit more bounce to it. Less likely to get dented and then rust and all that kind of stuff. I still, though, you know, the retro bear in me likes the, you know, the classy metal case. I just do. I just do. But I don't know if I'm willing to pay $444 for that. That seems a, a kind of a high-end ticket there for a little bit of a retro class. All right. We're back to the win. Look at this. Spiral head. Not not a two-blade. Not a three-blade. Spiral-headed blade for $457. Win is just eating everybody's lunch at this point. Uh, it, it's just amazing how much uh, of a value they can pack into that little machine there. All right, rigid. Now here's a three blade system from rigid. This, I mean, it's a good system. It's a solid system. 459. The question is, do you want a three blade system for 459 or a, or a spiral blade system for 457? That's really where you got to look at this kind of stuff. And then we talk about the, you know, we talked about grizzly before. Well, here's a grizzly three blade system. 474 it's a i mean it's a beautiful system look at it. it's nice setup you got the two bars at the top external that's kind of interesting nice i like the grab handles on it it looks like a great system but at 474 you know do i want that grizzly system it's got a one-year warranty i i don't know if I, I can justify that now dewalt are some of the big boys on the in the block here this is the dewalt's three blade system here this is their standard planer here uh, lunchbox style we've talked about it before it's three knife cutter head there uh, reversible knives so you get 30 percent more knife life Ooh. it's a good system it really is but do we have better options coming up well let's take a look at that shall we because we talked about this one at 499 well we got another delta another upgrade here if you will a uh, three blade system here in the delta for 579 it's a beautiful system here it's a beautiful setup it's it's got a nice dust port on the back it, it, it looks like a great system. Again, this is a newer system. I haven't had a chance to try it out. If you have, I'd love to hear your comments down below. I like the look of it. I like the, the what, at least what I've seen so far. But at 579, I'm going to have to see a lot more than just a three blade system. I It does have a five year professional grade warranty. I, I don't know what a professional grade warranty is. What, what makes your warranty professional? I don't know. Maybe they, they, there's some warranties though. I will say like Ryobi's infamous for being like, we have a three-year warranty unless you use this for professional work and then it's a one-year warranty. Maybe they don't have any exceptions in that and that's why it's a professional grade. We'll have to see. All right, but this is, this is the one I often talk about. This is the big boy. If you want to get serious without stepping up to, you know, near commercial grade, this is the planer you're going to want to look at. Now, this is a, it's bigger than your standard lunchbox. This is, you know, the hungry man style, if you will. Three knives. This is a, a heavy duty, two speed, uh, in feed table, out feed table. This is just a fantastic planer here. $600. So that's kind of the question is, do you want to go with the basic DeWalt for $4.99? Or if you're, you're spending that much money anyway, I say step up to this one. This is the one I often tell people. In fact, what we often say is, that it, unless you're unless you're you need something really specific, go with one of the budget planers. Go with go with one of the winds or the home or the Harbor Freight or or something like that because you're gonna get a lot of bang for your buck, especially with those wind. That three blade system, come on, that three blade system, that that's a, an incredible deal on that. And you're looking at three hundred and forty two dollars. You now have to spend two hundred and sixty dollars more if you want to get up to something serious like that like that dewalt system there this this is a great system to go with now going even up past this rikon has got their helical head planer here 689 dollars so basically you've got a great lunchbox style planer with a helical head not a three blade not a spiral helical head that's the top of the line there 
for $690. That's an incredible option. Then you've got Jet here. you got another uh, helical head option here in the Jet. Jet's always made great stuff, in my opinion. I'm a big fan of Jet. I don't know if $800 for a, for a standard you know system like this. If I want to go helical, what I'm probably going to do is I'm probably going to get this base DeWalt and get a replacement head for it. There's a couple options. For $360, I know they're not cheap. I'm not going to tell you that they are because you're already spending $600. You're now spending a bunch more to get this grizzly helical head for the DeWalt. But I'll tell you what, if you talk to some serious woodworkers, they're going to tell you the one to get is the bird. And the bird's the word. It's $455 just for the head. That better be some smooth wood. <laughs> anyway, there you go. If you got any other questions about uh, planers or and that kind of equipment, list it down below. If you want to see another video of this kind of style, let me know down below. Anyway, I hope we answered all your questions. By the way, while you're down there, don't forget to uh, chomp the old like button. Don't forget you can find my links to Skillshare down there. Be sure to check those out. Anyway, thanks again. You all take care. God bless. And as always, shine on.